have a huge haul for you guys. It's absolutely ridiculous. I have some things from Bath and Body Works and also Victoria's Secret, but I think I'm going to separate the two hauls because the amount of stuff that I have, this video would be way too long and you guys would just definitely like lose interest because it would just be way too long. So I'm going to go ahead and do a Bath and Body Works haul and then if you would like to see my Victoria's Secret haul, you can click right here or I'll have the link listed below. Um, yeah, so here recently, Victoria's Secret and Bath & Body Works, they have been having some insane sales. So, of course, being the addict that I am, I definitely had to hit them up. And I just want to let you guys know, everything I have is not from one shopping trip. It's actually from two separate weekends. One weekend, Bath & Body Works had buy three, get three of anything in the store for free. And then this past weekend, Bath & Body Works had their candles for eight dollars so yeah I just wanted to clear that up before you guys think that I'm just an absolute lunatic yeah they had some awesome sales so that's why I decided to pick up all of these things and I also had a ton of coupons so um, when they had the candles on sale for eight dollars I used a 10 off of 30 yeah I used a 10 off of 30 coupon so I got four candles for twenty two dollars so yeah you definitely cannot beat that with a stick so I love to save all of my coupons so that's pretty much much how I get a really good deal on these like yeah I had like I had probably about 20 coupons I still have some but I don't think I'm going back to Bath and Body Works so yeah um we're just gonna go ahead and get started um I have not one not two not three but four bags of candles from Bath and Body Works. So yeah, this is going to be absolutely insane. And then I have a whole um, bag of body care items from Bath and Body Works because the body care items were buy three, get three free, and I think that they're going to, um, I think they're going to run that sale throughout Christmas. So yeah, you can still get that. So we're gonna go ahead and start with the candles now that I've given you guys a 10 minute intro. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with bag one. So they were really nice and they put all of the candles in this little crate. So I thought that that was really convenient. So um, the first candle that I want to show you guys is called Vanilla Latte and this is from the Winter Market line and I'm not going to try to explain what each one smells like but pretty much this one is vanilla -y. Not one of my favorites but since it was such a good deal I just decided to go ahead and get it. The next one is one of my favorites. I cannot believe that I had not smelled this sooner. This one's called Lemon, Lemon Mint Leaf. It looks like that and this one smells really good it kind of reminds me of like springtime and like I don't know it just smells really good um, you can really smell the lemon in this one so I ended up getting two of these and that was just on my first trip so I might have the same candle in some other bags so the next one that I want to talk about is one that you guys were like oh my gosh nature you have to try it out so yeah I want to thank you guys for not letting me sleep on this one like y'all did with mahogany teak wood but yeah it's flannel you guys were like oh my gosh check flannel out if you think mahogany teak wood is too strong you'll absolutely love flannel and I really do like I think I ended up getting about five of these and it smells really really nice like like everyone was telling me, if mahogany teak wood is too strong for you, definitely check out flannel because it's just, it's just a perfect, like, I don't know, it's perfect. And then I have another flannel candle in this crate, so I ended up getting two of those. And the last one in this crate is cinnamon and clove buds, which I don't really like. I don't know why I got it. I don't know, it's okay. It's a little bit strong with the cinnamon, but I think it'll be really nice in the kitchen maybe. So yeah, that is all of the six candles from the first crate. Okay, so now I have a whole nother crate of candles. And this one, it has more of the winter market candles. So um, this one is called Merry Mango. And um, I really like this one. It's really fruity. Um, I think it would be perfect for summertime or springtime. And I ended up getting two of this one. And again, it's Merry Mango. I got another one of the vanilla lattes that I showed you in the first crate. The next one is also from the Winter Market, and this one's called Sparkling Berries and Pears. It smells really nice, and that's what it looks like. The next one is called Party Dress, which is a new favorite of mine, and I think this is a new line that they have in Bath & Body Works. Um, they also have one that's called Black Tie that I really like, and I'll show you some of those later. But yeah, this one smells really good. It kind of has like a cologne scent, 
smells amazing. And then I have Twisted Peppermint, and this one is from the Holiday Traditions. It smells just like a um, peppermint. So that was the six from that crate. Now I have another crate. Um, the first one from this crate is Marshmallow Fireside. You guys know I love this one. If you've been watching my videos for a while, you know I've loved this one since like last year around this time. So yeah, this one is absolutely amazing. And my friend Brandy actually was the one who got me hooked on this one. I went to her house one time and I smelled it and I was like, oh my gosh, that smells so good. So ever since then, I've really been loving um, the Marshmallow Fireside. And then I have another one of the party dress. And this one, oh my gosh, you guys, this one smells really good. So I definitely had to get more than one. I have another Marshmallow Fireside. I think I got like three of these because I really love that one. Um, the next one is called Holiday. And I really like this one. It's kind of a cinnamony, but it's not too much cinnamon. Kind of like the cinnamon and clove buds. This one is just perfect. And, um... Yeah, it says it just has a blend of cinnamon and clove. So yeah, it smells really, really nice. I also got another flannel because this is one of my new favorites. So I cannot wait to burn that one. I haven't burned it yet. And then I got another one of the lemon mint leaf because this one smells so, so good. And I heard a couple of people on YouTube talk about this one. I think I heard AK Doll talk about this one. So um, I smelled it and I really, really like it. So yeah. Alright you guys, so I have one more bag of candles to show you guys. And um, these, I don't have a crate, so it's going to be more than six. It's actually probably about ten, so I'm just going to dig into the bag and show you guys. So the first one from that bag is Marshmallow Fireside. I'm kind of embarrassed about how many of these that I got, but it smells so, so amazing. And um, this one just smells like everything that you can think of for winter time. So yeah, if you haven't smelled this one, then definitely go smell it. I um, also got a cinnamon caramel swirl. Um, I was kind of getting away from the really, really sweet smelling candles. I don't know, but um, I decided to get a few of them just in case, you know, I started liking them again. This one smells really good. The only thing with the sweet ones is I noticed that they kind of get overbearing really quickly. But this one smells good, but it is really, really sweet. The next one I have is leaves. And I did not recognize leaves. Um, they have like new packaging. I don't know. It just doesn't look like it used to look. And it used to be like um, brown wax and now it's white. So I definitely did not recognize this one. This one used to be one of my really, um, really favorite ones. Really favorite ones? It used to be one of my favorites. So I really like this one. But I only got one of them because I don't know. I, I just feel like it didn't, like I feel like it doesn't smell the same like it did last year. And then this one is Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. The name definitely describes it really well. It smells like a sweet cinnamon pumpkin. And this next one is Black Tie. I've really been looking forward to getting on here and telling you guys about this one. Oh my gosh, you guys. This one smells like a really sexy man. You guys know how mahogany teak wood smells like a sexy man? This one smells like a really sexy man. And would it be racial if I said a really sexy black man? Like... I don't know. It's something about this one that just smells amazing. Oh my gosh, I love it. It smells so, so good. So yeah, if you have not smelled black tie, go smell this one. Oh my gosh, you'll be dreaming about some sexy black men. And I'm not lying, like this one smells really good. Yeah, I love this one. Black tie, definitely the business. Especially if you're single, you're going to love that one. I got another Twisted Peppermint because I love this one. I think I'm going to burn this one in my makeup room. And then I got a vanilla, a vanilla, a vanilla firewood. And this one smells really different. You can definitely smell the firewood in this one. But I like it. I think I should have gotten more than one of these. And speaking of getting more than one, I only got one black tie. Can you guys believe that? I have to go get more of the black tie. So I know they're still having two for 22 and I have some $10 off 30 coupons. So yeah, I gotta go get black tie. More black tie. But um, yeah, the vanilla firewood, it's different. And I love that you can smell every hint of what it says it has. Like, I definitely smell the vanilla and I smell the firewood. So, yeah, I like that one a lot. Oh, yeah, there's the front of it. It smells really nice. And the very last candle that I got is the Heirloom Pear. And this one smells really, really nice. This was my first time smelling this one, but I kind of like it. I'm not really crazy about it, but 
it smells pretty good since it was only eight dollars and i got a really good deal on it so yeah all right y'all so that was all of the candles that i got now i want to show you guys the body care items i got quite a bit of body care items because they were buy three get three free so what i decided to do to kind of minimize things was i took away anything that i got for a gift because i got um colton a lot of things from their um, men's signature line so i just went ahead and put those away because maybe if they're watching they may know it's for them so yeah i just thought it would be easier that way and it just won't be as much stuff to show so yeah everything that i'm going to show you guys is mine which I'm kind of embarrassed to say although like I do have a lot of other body care items that I got like for gifts and stuff so it's not too bad um so yeah I have two bags of body care items this bag is pretty much full of twisted peppermint because not only do I love the candle but I love the body fragrance in it as well and then this one is just random scents and oh and I also have these little knickknacks that I want to show you guys I got one of the um the little soap covers and then I got this it holds soaps as well and I think I'm going to put this in the kitchen before Christmas is over because this has like um little deer on it I think maybe I could use it all year round maybe I don't know so I'm gonna go ahead and dig in and show you guys all of the um, body care items so the first fragrance that I decided to go back to I have not used since I was probably in high school I almost forgot how good it smells I got the warm vanilla sugar and this smells amazing i think it's one of those fragrances that can be worn either winter or summer it smells really really good so i got this in the triple moisture body cream because i really really love those and then i got it in the creamy body wash and then i also got it in the body lotion so those were the three things that i got for um warm vanilla sugar and another one of my favorites from bath and body works is the paris amour so i got quite a few of these i got the paris amour in the creamy body wash then I also got the Paris Amour in the shower gel, and I got another one of the creamy body washes, and I got another body lotion. Um, I also got the Paris Amour in the triple moisture body cream. You can never have too much body cream. And then I got another body lotion in the Paris Amour as well. And um, a new fragrance that I tried out was this coconut lime breeze. So I went ahead and got three of these. So I got um, a shower gel. I got the spray and then I also got the triple moisture body cream in that as well. I also got some of the little minis. I got a shower gel and warm vanilla sugar and then I got um, the body lotion and warm vanilla sugar and I got the Paris Amour um, body lotion and I just got these for whenever I go on vacation or anything like this. You can just throw me your little travel bag and I think this is the size of you know what's like airplane approval okay so I have one more bag and then this really humongous haul will be over with and this one is full of um, body care items as well but this one is mostly twisted peppermint so um, I got the twisted peppermint lotion I got another twisted peppermint lotion I got the twisted peppermint shower gel I got another twisted peppermint lotion why did I get so many and then I also got the twisted peppermint shower gel I have a twisted peppermint body spray and then I have a twisted I got two of these I got two twisted peppermint hand sanitizers to go on my desk so yeah that is all of my twisted peppermint and then I got three things for oh. <laughs> three things from the true blue spa and um, most of these things are for your feet I got the smoothing foot scrub and then I got the spa strength callus treatment it looks like that and then the last thing I got was the super rich foot cream so yeah I really really love the true blue spa if you guys haven't tried out their lines and you definitely should do so so that was all of the things that I got from Bath and Body Works I know it was a really huge haul I had so many candles but they just had a really good sale and be sure to like keep all of your coupons so you can use them whenever they have a really good deal like this because that's what really helped me out because all of this stuff did not cost that much like I didn't go below like $300 or anything like that I probably spent probably around $200 so yeah I just feel like that was a really really good deal considering all of the things that I got and I probably won't need any more Bath and Body Works things for a while but does that mean that I'm not gonna shop there 
No, I'll probably be there when they have their semi-annual sale, yeah, because I have a lot of coupons for that. So it's pretty, it's sad, I know it's really sad, but I hope you guys enjoyed this haul, and if you did a Bath and Body Works haul, be sure to link it below because they don't have video response anymore. I don't know why they stopped doing that, but yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching, and if you want to see the Victoria's Secret haul, I'll have it listed below because it should be coming up right after this haul because it would have just been too much stuff to put in one video. Yeah, I love you guys, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!